Hello friends, welcome back to All Unknown Law and this is a rapid revising pearl. So today I'm going to talk about the clue points to the hemolysis as the cause for anemia. So when you should think that the cause for this anemia in this patient in new SMLE is due to hemolysis. So what are the things you should look for? Cause clue to hemolysis. Okay, so let's talk. Most important, look at the LDH level. If it's elevated, then it can, it is a hemolysis, hemolytic as a cause for this anemia. Okay, increase bilirubin. Okay, if this patient has a jaundice. Very good. Tell, tell me about the haptoglobin. Should it be raised or low or normal? If it's a low or absent, then only it indicates it's a hemolysis, low or absent. Okay? And if you see pigmented gallstones, pigmented gallstones, or any history of cholecystectomy, okay? Then look for what you call urobilinogen or bilirubin or hemoglobin in urine. Urobilinogen, bilirubin or hemoglobin in urine. Okay? And what about uh, what you call this low or what you call haptoglobin indicates only intravascular hemolysis. Okay, guys? So this is very important points. Try to look for these important points in the USMLE case scenario to know whether it's a cause is cause for this anemia is whether it's a hemolysis or not. Thank you so much for watching this video. Take care.